All right, welcome back to your balance diet of TeleTV. Now, every day for inside what we do in Nigeria, different businesses they actually start up. Now, how different businesses do they start up and the number of people where they actually start up business every day till they increase? The same way, now some of them till they actually pack out because some of them not even get the right skills to take and manage their business, to they build their customer service base and also to take access loans, especially um, to make sure say, their business go they very, very casual. And that's now why we can't sit down and say, why this thing they happen? Why we get number, a large number of people where they start business, and we also see get a large number of people where we say, after two months where they start their business, they could just pack up. Why we get this um, large um, uh, numbers? That's now why we get this casual people inside the house. We go tell you the solution where you go make everything they very, very casual. Now, we get a video to play for you, but make I just quickly introduce this guest. We get um, Priya Amanani. She's now the head of, head of business development, Omnibiz Africa. Good to have Hello. you in the house. And we get the enterprise and partnership um, person for here, Imna Uchena Michael. Good to have you. Thank you. Now, to learn more concerning Omnibiz Africa, make you watch this video. <laughs> On Wednesday, 16th of October 2019, SME Economy Africa, in partnership with VConnect and Omnibiz, gathered entrepreneurs from various fields of businesses to a masterclass themed Tech and the Growth of the New Nigerian Economy. This mega tech masterclass sessions focused on e commerce, dropshipping, sourcing business funds, digital marketing, and these were discussed by a collective in the industry as panelists. The most important thing to be is that you need to be sure what is one message you need to you need to you want to pass out. And in doing that, I think all of us have succeeded in helping provide a platform where you can almost at one press of a button interact with all your TV platforms. Meaning that the beauty of what you get out of it will be dependent on what kind of message. People don't have time. People are so impatient, people are so and oftentimes the kind of message you pass across will determine the response you get. So because up to time it is said in life that what you say is not as important as how you say it. And now you say it might not be as important as when it is said. The beauty of your message, make it clear. What is that you are offering? Say it in the books, me, 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 me. say it so, so briefly that people can pick up the message at a glance. And what they do, you can be sure of having immediate response. So when I talk to SMEs and young clients, I always tell them, do you have a digital you know, presence? Like, where can I find you? And when I find you, what can I find you doing? So you have some people, they actually have online presence, but they're actually doing the wrong things on that page. So for instance, you're cooking, but everything you're putting there is close. It doesn't add or match up. So and that's your business. You know, 95% of everything you do on that page should be cooking. So that people know when they come to a page, it's easy to just say, oh, so ABC is into food business, and this is what she does. This is a great time to be in Nigeria and get access to funds. Um, when I came here 11 years ago, and when we started our business 16 years ago in this country, it was almost impossible for people to get access to credit. You literally had to know the president of the company or the <laughs> MD of the company or be the son of you know, the president or the something like that. And now it is actually, funds are available. Lenders, that's how they make money. They make money by giving money to credit-worthy people and those people are paying them back. So just know that that is, it, it's, it's a good time. From personal experience and from my work experience, I would say the right medium or the right media that you should employ to your business is one, the one that is most relevant to your environment because at the end of the day you're in business to meet the demands of other people uh, and not in business to satisfy your own demands. If you were in business to satisfy your own demand, you would use the medium that you think you are most comfortable with. The convener, Emmanuel Ezima, also stated that this has been going on for a while now and using these platforms to bring entrepreneurs far and wide of small businesses to start up and have the ability to grow. He said a growing Nigeria depends on the growing SMEs and is calling out to all young entrepreneurs of SMEs and MSMEs to get involved and move their businesses forward.
Very nice one. Nice one. Now, one thing we did over here to say, Omnibus Africa don't they here to make sure say growth for inside the business um, sector, for especially for SMEs, it did very, very cajard. But now, I just want to ask you quickly before we talk more about Omnibus Africa. Now, we get some businesses where we say they get online presence. Um, that they try to pass the message very well across to people consigned within that they sell. But to get that customer, that's still a problem for them. What do you feel say they know they do right? Uh, okay. Uh, <clears throat> one of the major challenges we uh, businesses they get, not be just because they didn't get online presence. Now, how they take the manage the online presence? So one customer now gets presence for, get websites, you get Facebook, you get Instagram, you get all of those different online yes. presence, mm -hmm. right? So, but then the question now, how him take the manager, each of them? So, okay. so because uh, you cannot serve two masters at, at a time, right? Mm -hmm. So him will give more attention to one than the other. So what if at a minute or at a time, your customer suppose come from another platform, but right now you are focusing on one platform. You understand? So they don't feel manage all of them at the same time. So if you if you go feel effectively manage all of them at the same time, then you'll be more attractive to all or the type of customers that fits your business from all of those platforms. So now waiting Omnibus they help do now say Omnibus don't create a platform. We go help you manage all of them inside one place. So you don't need to log on to Facebook. You don't need to log on to Instagram. You don't need to log on to Twitter. You don't need to log on to LinkedIn to do updates on any of those ones. What you need now from Omnibus interface, anything where you want post, even if now 50 pictures of your product, you want advertise them, you push them from Omnibus and you go to all of them at the same time. So none of them is lacking. And then if somebody need your service from any of those platforms, it comes straight to one place. So you don't need Many times people they people they look for your service for Facebook but you're busy for Instagram. People they look for your service from LinkedIn but you're busy for Twitter. Okay, but like this, all of them will come inside one place. So effective management of your online presence is very key. So now waiting many businesses, Nova Feed do bigger businesses, they pay people to manage each of those ones individually. Now why then they get value from and do that? Mm, I like that. Now, make I speak with prayer. You and I, um, business development person, you sabi work on signing this. And I know so you don't actually interact with a lot of business owners for inside Webodo, Nigeria, especially. Now, some people will come outside talk, say, the reason why my business not they flourish well for Nigeria now, because they will not get the, they go put English, enabling environment. Now, in as much as we know, say, we get some factors where you know they support businesses for Nigeria, which other thing, if you say business is supposed to do, to actually improve their services? So one of the things, you know, we often speak about is access to funds. Sorry, I'm going to switch a bit to no, English. I know, I know. <laughs> so um, one of the things businesses always talk about is access to funds. And there are so many government institutions or other institutions that are offering this money. And they even get the pressure that, you know, provide these funds to businesses. Mm -hmm. But a lot of times businesses fail to access that fund because of lack of being able to show their ability to pay. So a lot of times we think it's collateral, but it's not necessarily collateral that you need for a loan. Mm. It's to be able to show the, the person you are lending the money from that you have the ability to pay back. To pay back. Mm -hmm. And because, you are, because on Omnibus, outside of just online presence management, businesses can manage their sales, manage their sales team, do inventory management and do invoicing as well. Because of all of that, they are able to build a history of their business which is being captured digitally. And the next time they need a loan, they have all of this to show that, you know, I have a running business. I have money which is moving. I have the ability to pay back. But let me just get access to this money so that I can grow my business to the next level. Well, how long business do you actually stay before you access loan? Because we see how it be now. It's not easy for you to just start business today and then money go to flow in. How long if you say a, a person will get business will stay in the market before you start applying for loans? Okay, um, you see, loan, loan assessments now don't be simpler than it be before. Okay. Okay, so if you even day for your house now, apply for loan, you go still get them. Mm. So, but the major challenge where businesses get, like uh, Priya said, now say, 
no track record of what things you did do. So even if you can provide a very good track record of your inflow and outflow, okay, for two, three, four, five months, and then you present them. Now, you know, if you know if you access 10 million naira at once, okay. okay, but within that short period of time, if then you track your integrity, that time, say, every single thing where you do for your business, get track record. It gets amount of loan where you go free access within that period. Okay, so you don't need to wait forever to do to free apply for loan. Within your first two, three months, you free apply for loan. So long you are credit worthy, you will then know say you fit pay. So there is the willingness to pay, there is the ability to pay. So then with that one, then then go free guarantee, say you get the ability to pay back, so they will feel trust you. I like that. Apart from the fact that OmniBiz Africa, they actually um, give businesses ideas on how to access loans. I know say, now they do plenty of other things. Tell us more about the betterness of they do. So one of the things where we help businesses is in capturing data. So if you go to any business or any office, the first thing you see, you go and you register in a book. Yes. Where you write your number mm -hmm. and your email address, Very true. right? Yes. And I don't know about you, but I more than you know nine times out of ten, I put a wrong number. Exactly. Because... <laughs> I just tell you, I'm like, what did, did it for, really? Exactly. Mm -hmm. But now imagine if you went to an office, right, and okay. they actually captured that number okay. and they verified it, mm. just so they know who you are, right? So the next time you you come in, they greet you, hello, miss, how are you doing, and how was your last visit? right you feel there's you feel a connection yes. yes you you instantly connect mm. and the experience you have with the business is phenomenal I right agree. so that's one of the ways in which we are helping businesses mm. in you know creating that sort of experience with their clients getting to know them more by capturing their data and using that to help them to provide a better experience in the long run, some people don't understand the customer service is key to make your yes. business grow. But instead of me to talk, in the long run, how does one would they translate into profit for your business? So in the long run, right, it's yes. if I have five happy customers, they'll bring me 15. If you ask any business, they say, yes, I do social media, I do this, I do this. But which is your biggest source of customers? Referrals. Mm. Always, sure. by far. And that's the way that you will key into referrals. If every customer who you service has a good thing to say about you, then you know that referrals are always going to come in. Mm, I like that. The most cost-effective marketing, right? I know. I like <laughs> that. Now, apart from, apart from that, now they actually do trainings for business owners. Yes, yes. Um, at least with the video we, we just play. So, so, uh, so every month we they do training for business owners okay. and then we they invite professionals in different fields. So like the last one we would do, SME Economy Africa, uh, we bring professionals from, from the banking sector, from the uh, credit sector, which is loan. Okay. okay so we bring professionals from e-commerce. Mm -hmm. We bring professionals from media. Okay. So me they can talk to businesses. So me be like, only we they talk to them, right? Mm -hmm. So me they can talk to businesses. Me then tell businesses, see, this is what it takes out there. These are the things you are not doing right, right? So if you do it this way, it will yield for your business more. So for people who want to access loan, if these are uh, these, these and this. Now, what you need to do to figure access to those loans? And the people we will actually bring, many of them are the, the owner of the loan company itself. So you are hearing from the horse's mouth directly. Mm -hmm. You get so So we do this kind of training to empower businesses from different sector. So, and many more of those businesses, they happen, which we, they always publicize for uh, businesses to fee attend. I like that. Now, I know say Omnibus Africa, not be only Nigeria, they're day, they're day for other countries to tell us your success story so far. So, so far it's, you know, one step at a time. I know. When you take, so we launched in January, a soft launch, but our official launch was in July. In Nigeria. In Nigeria, yeah. And from there, it's just been bringing together each business and getting to know them and getting to understand their challenges. So with a solution like this, it's very important for us to step into the shoes of the person we are trying to solve a problem for and really understand their business and see how can we make our technology be implemented in their business. So it's been at a small scale, but it's been going well.
I know. So how business owners will actually access on our platform? Uh, they're very simple. Um, they just need to go to www.omnibiz.com. Okay. Okay. Yes. I better come again. Make <laughs> one Not to say you know yet. Hear it. Make your business grow. <laughs> www.omnibiz.com. Spell the omnibiz for them. O M N I B I Z. Okay. All right. Okay. Z. Me no be the O M N I B I Z. Okay. okay. And then uh, register. Somebody okay. will call you. Okay, okay, now just to register. Yes. I'm not going to pay any money to register. No, 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 no. Registration are free. So free. Yes. And person will call them. Yes, person will call them. All right, you don't hear Ram. If you want to make your business grow, if you want to make you get the right skills on how to win customers, follow them on top of their platform. It did there. It said www.omnibiz.com. Very easy. And then when you register free, um, person will call you. You get any message again to give people where they watch us? So all I would say is come on the platform. We're here to help you grow. And um, there is a lot that we can also learn from understanding your businesses. So we look forward to getting to know about you. I like that. Oh, yeah, give them, uh, give them, <laughs> tell them something. Okay, see, um, um, we get wonderful CRM tools for businesses. Will you go fit take manage your business activity day in, day out? We won't move on a come up from the normal paper thing to something better. Okay, so thank you very much. All right, you don't hear from them. Thank you very much. Say you're inside the house to talk about how businesses go there very, very kajad for inside we Obodo, Nigeria, especially the growth of businesses. Now, the people who would they speak with, would they speak with um, um, Priya Amanani? I love your name. Thank where, you. Where you come from? Uh, India. <laughs> uh, obviously. Uh, how long does it for Nigeria? Uh, almost five years now. Ah! Yes. Wow, you don't take for you well, well. No. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. So Thank you come. You. Sheena, the head of business development. And we get Uchena Michael in our enterprise and partnership person. We understand um, the importance of partnership. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. To enjoy more of this, our Ogunke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.